you know, when you look back at loading that first roll of 16 millimeter film, it was really cool to feel the birth of TGR right there. My mom really wanted us to go to college, and um, I was never in the cards for me. I didn't really like school too much, and I just told her, you know, surfing is something I really want to do, and I, I really want to, you know, try to, you know, pursue the career. And I know the guys were being paid to surf and travel, and um, those were two things I really wanted to do. Surfing was definitely, you know, my ticket. Serving for me still is, you know, fresh and new. Is, it's always been, um, no matter how bad the waves are, or, or if it's good, it's you know always nice. But if, if it's not great, I'm, I'm out there either way. I surf every single day because I love it, and it's given me, you know, a great lifestyle. And um, you know, I forever will owe surfing because it's given me so much. Andy just like, it makes, it opens all of the kids from Hawaii's eyes to see how much he's done and like where, where he's gone with surfing to the fact that like we could all be there one day. Brian and Ian, yeah, I'm both kids from Hawaii, so I've actually grown up watching them surf. I remember them when they were little puppies. Jamie was running around the tide pools at Pipeline, grabbing people's broken boards, and uh, now he's out at Pipeline taking the biggest waves, so it's pretty funny. Brian's a, he's been a friend of mine since we were about 12 years old doing a little amateur contest. He's just always been able to surf good waves really, really well. Like he's got a really good style, he's different, it's really cool to see. And he's young, he's my age, won the Pipe Masters. I mean, you can't, you can't win a better contest in the world, I don't think. 